good morning to everybody today i will discuss the super heterodyne receiver which is used in television system fm system radar system there are early discuss there are two types of receiver trf receiver and super heterodyne receiver TRF receiver has some difficulties or disadvantage which is selectivity and sensitivity is very poor so we use super heterodyne receiver this is a receiver which is used in television radar and fm radio system what is super heterodyne receiver or why it is called the super heterodyne receiver heterodyne means heterodyne means mixing which receiver has mixing stage is called the super heterodyne receiver the receiver which has a mixing stage is called the super heterodyne receiver okay so it is called super heterodyne receiver because there is a mixing stage this is the block diagram of a super heterodyne receiver here there is a mixing stage so this block diagram is called heterodyne receiver first key now first the signal this is the antenna okay this is the antenna the signal is received by the antenna the incoming signal is received by the antenna and passes through a rf stage okay passes through a rf stage here uh, in super heterodyne receiver convert super heterodyne receiver convert high frequency high frequency into low frequency okay super heterodyne receiver convert high frequency into low frequency okay in the super heterodyne receiver the signal processing means this stage this is the stage is called the signal processing signal processing signal processing signal processing is lower frequency okay so lower frequency so super heterodyne receiver convert high frequency into low frequency so first the antenna is uh, first sorry first the signal is received by the antenna and goes to the rf stage here rf stage means rf stage means rf stage means tuned amplifier rf stage here rf stage is a tuned amplifier circuit tuned amplifier circuit means which tuned which tuned or which select the desired signal or reject the unwanted signal so rf stage has the following characteristic better better selectivity selectivity okay second is better sensitivity sensitivity okay uh, third is reject the unwanted unwanted frequency this is the following characteristic of rf stage basically rf stage is a basically rf stage is a tuned amplifier circuit here class c amplifier is used class c amplifier there are uh, four types of amplifier class a class b class c class d and class ab so here class c amplifier is used this is the rf stage okay next stage is mixing stage mixture mixing there are two mixing means there are two frequency is mixed there are two frequency is mixed one is incoming frequency 
incoming frequency okay which is denoted by fs and local oscillator oscillator frequency which is denoted by f0 these two frequency is mixed by the mixture okay basically mixer is a non linear device basically mixer is a non linear device which produce the differences of two signals which produce differences of two signals means the output of the mixture is the output the output of the mixture fi the output of the mixture is denoted by fi okay the output of the mixture is denoted by fi fi equal to f0 minus of fs means f0 is the local oscillator frequency and fs is called the incoming frequency okay here okay here f0 always greater than fs local oscillator frequency is always greater than incoming frequency okay so fi fi is called the intermediate frequency intermediate frequency okay so mixture is produced the intermediate frequency here two frequency is mixed and produce a single frequency this frequency is the difference between the two incoming frequency which is incoming frequency and lo local oscillator frequency this frequency is called the intermediate frequency which is difference between the two frequencies okay this is the mixing stage here uh, the receiver is called the heterodyne means mixing heterodyne mean mixing here the main mixing stage next the if signal is fed to the if amplifier okay this signal is further amplification by the if amplifier if signal is amplified if signal means intermediate frequency if is is called the intermediate frequency intermediate frequency is further amplified 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 by the amplifier which amplifier the ce amplifier here the ce amplifier is used in if amplifier why ce is amplifier is used now this amplifier has high gain gain is high so the in the if stage if amplification stage the common emitter amplifier is used okay next uh, means local oscillator local oscillator which generate the oscillator frequency which generate the frequency which generate the high frequency high frequency is called the local oscillator which generate the high frequency generally uh, crystal oscillator is used for local oscillator here the local oscillator is higher frequency and if amplifier is always for standard uh, frequency 455 kilohertz okay if amplifier is always for super heterodyne receiver is 445 uh, 455 kilohertz means a if frequency is f0 minus fs um, uh, so intermediate frequency is always 455 kilohertz local oscillator local oscillator is usually higher than the incoming signal frequency higher than the incoming signal frequency which is equal to the 455 kilohertz 455 kilohertz next stage is d modulator if stage next stage is d modulator d modulator okay demodulator means such a detection the signal detection the original signal okay detection the original signal is called the demodulations okay which is original original signal means such a audio signal which recover demodulator is a circuit which recover the original audio signal okay next audio amplifier next audio amplifier amplifier the output of the demodulator is key 
the output of the demodulated is audio signal means low frequency signal low frequency signal frequency signal okay the low frequency signal is amplified by audio amplifier audio amplifier because the low signal so it is amplified by the audio amplifier which is a also a common emitter amplifier which is also a common emitter amplifier okay this is also a common emitter amplifier if common emitter amplifier is used in audio amplifier okay the mm -hmm. next stage is power amplifier next stage is power amplifier the output the output of the audio amplifier is fed to the this is the power audio amplifier is complete this is the power amplifier power amplification which amplify the power level of the signal power level of the signal which amplify the power level of the signal is called the power amplifier class c power amplifier is used class c power amplifier power amplifier is used power level of the signal which increases the power level of the signal here also used for power amplifier impedance matching impedance matching okay here for two purpose to use the power amplifier first is uh, power amplifier increases the power level of the signal and second is power amplifier improve the impedance network or impedance matching network to deliver to deliver the signal or to deliver the load okay then output of the power amplifier is fed to the speaker 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 is a transducer speaker is a transducer which convert electrical signal electrical signal into sound energy sound signal sound energy electrical energy converted into sound energy is called the speaker so we hear some sound in the speaker thus the original signal is produced thus the original signal is produced 